asori mu a omo so so eye somebody and i say omo ye one of the empany phone bi e wo asori mu na eh se wuti eni ya na a prophet kofi puku ena e kasai na moma yen kan kre eneno eh awarie egu pa awarie egu na the reason why ya ene ya peke topic ki ene se awarie so so e ye center of our lives se eh be ma oba na se muti fie na se ma wari en kuyia e feti mo spiritual life e feti e affect mo finances mo si kasem e affect even your health en kole wo fie nyina no omunya impact enya impact greater impact bi e wo omo so e bi ni se se parents na e konto kwa en kola ne peke oni oni ni a go won de bia na oni ni wife ana oni ni kunu na omo peke en Entino enfa asumbie emma ifie enfa asumbie emma ejuma even to ase wuni ukuna na wuni uyere na se entokwa wawa ukwa ejuma mwa you are you are disturbed ungu ta soundness of mind eba ni sasa wuni self control ewo wabra boso ana bibia ube ibia entino e wase ye di wun emkomo na ene ye find out why na ye fani the solution se de ya ye be nya ye be enjoy the 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 goodness ah e wo awariye mu amen amen ah e chuma die yi ah me nko wa me ntimi enye enu ntino onyakopon ama me great women of god a abu o hasi o bebu ame ama ma ye ejumadi na se ama ejumadi no aye de aba successful enti mi we see time meche o mo na se ye di ye ye sa na se ye be tua o mo e waha na o mo a introduce o mo ebi a wuni mo we bu o so so bi so so eni o mo enti no o mo be introduce o mo e waha se na ye hu o mo se de yampo u chro bi bi kwa apu message a na se o be so ma contribution a o be ti mi akasa na obo ni pakoni bi se mama we ana se eh o we e ka se na wa me ki sa point no you are welcome ladies you are welcome thank you sir me pacho eh we dey eh o be introduce o mo na the viewers no so so ehu eh o mo a o mo ne o mo eye de e bi sa topic no ho en ko mo pacho eh Make that Nyako Pass for everybody's life. God bless you for tuning in. This is your beloved lady, Lady Rita. God bless you all for watching. Amen. Amen. And let us say, Lady Rita, Lady Rita, Lady Rita, you are telling me, you are telling me, you are telling me, Amen. You are welcome. You are welcome. Thank you, Daddy. Mama Pacho also saw it. I don't know what I'm saying. I don't know what I'm saying. Amen. Osofu, and I say Osofu wa. Gifty, Mama Gifty. In na your friend, Mama Gifty. Oya Osofu wa. And you don't be surprised to say, "Oh, Emma, I will pass this time." Amen. Amen. Uh, yeah, we see time. Now we can say program is ultimately near. Now a year prophet Kufi Puku and a air can say, uh, yeah, we see time. We want to go straight, hit the hammer on the nail. Uh, and then you yeah, experience a lot of broken homes. Mm. Our rear air collapse, especially, especially in Europe and now say, make us say abroad. I seen a crew in Ghana. And you know, and every person you focus on, I was area one more. 
na ansa na yebe ko deep no ana yebe ko straight to why no eh me pese betie fo no omuhu omoti imi meaning of marriage ya ka se aware kra na ene aware kra efrihi ene bae what is marriage and efrihi where did it come from me watch your lady rita god bless you so much eh se ya she marriage ya uh, in Nipa family, you know, how I it me describing what a marriage is between two people that is a man and a woman now or more are joining together as husband and wife. But notwithstanding, say when you go to the Bible, Genesis, that is where you who why God instituted marriage because not our purpose be for it. Because uh, the Bible said, say when his friend Adam said he was alone. Now, Okashwe Adam said, I will make you a suitable helper, a, a person who will be a helper, a suitable, the best person that can be uh, uh, your helpmate. You are compatible with that person. So that that person will be born with vision and they will be able to reality. By so doing, so, so you will multiply when you read uh, Genesis 3. You say, Ain't you know? Uh, the Bible, no, and I say, you know, three more porn, no, one just creates marriage, say, uh, you're for the fun of it, but it's for a vision to come to reality and also for the multiplication of the earth. And it's here, and I will institute marriage. The multiplication of the earth. Mm. Mama, but you what's the idea now? We'll be to me, I can't have a marriage. Mm. Mm. Marriage, dear, is between two adults, mm. a female, not a girl. A female and a, the, the male, mm -hmm. not a, a not a boy, a man. Mm -hmm. Two people mm -hmm. in union. Yeah, and that is called mm -hmm. married. That is yeah. married between yeah. two people. Two people. Yes, yeah. two adults, mm -hmm. not two children. Mm -hmm. and, you know, uh, mm -hmm. we were right as we said in uh, Genesis that. The Lord said that it is no good for a man to, to be to, to live alone. You know, yeah. And you know, he created mm. Eve to be the helpmate. Meaning mm. that man will be a all year. Mm. And our man so and then a says so wow for a demand. Mm. And this bear man no any be be a all year. Mm. Now come away or bad see what mm. man would think say, oh the all year. Mm. But the bear man will be be a all year. Yeah. Or this one will be a all year. Or Modern be a warble. Yes. To a man so bad, or man of them say, Oh, may a panama be a war would not hear who could cree, what to me, and who could crack a seal, a seal, yeah, so on. Yeah. Or Bible Tyler said, Hm, but then my dad would not be a so pretty or Tina Pita. Hm, it's not a man, it is not for small boys. And it's not for yes, and to and to add up or no. Uh, marriage is actually for certain money air can is for two matured people. Mm -hmm. It's not just maturity with age, but also maturity with understanding mm -hmm. what life really is, understanding the responsibilities that you have to put in in building that marriage because you have to be mentally sound, emotionally uh, well carried out. Because in marriage, you know, there are a lot of emotions, there are a lot of things you have to do. There are a lot of sacrifices you have to put in to make the marriage work. Um, <clears throat> Lady Rita, but you can ascend. Oh, say, uh, on your coupon, you will say, bear my now, or boy, you know, not the money alone. Yeah, and that on your make and make it comment to be a honor or say it is not good. That is uh, Genesis 2 18. Yeah, it I must it say, mm. or it is not good mm. for man. To be alone. Yes. Ain't he? Uh, Yakopo Aye, when in his own wisdom, no. I know, say, me bought ne helper. Yes. Aye, they are man. Yes. They per se, yeah, this are when a tohon, ne helper. Ain't nature say, Obano, aye, ne helper. Obano, aye, ne helper. Obano, aye, uh, the Obabe, ye, a juman. Or the Ejumano or Bog Garden or Ye Bibian or the Garden or Eshe Adam on Sam. And you know, not Adam on a fishing career. And no Bog helper. According to what Lady Rita Ayer the Eka, you know. 
Okay. And you know, uh, in other sense, you know, mm. um, nature said, place bear na oba a place a wo marriage, you know. Position bear and na oba a place a wo marriage, you know. Um, let me ask you, oba a two bear no afraid. Because being the help mates, you know, mm -hmm. a deep you oba, I said, what what be a company? Na eh uh, ona na wafa obi mm -hmm. wafa obi like wafa obi the same manager na boss no power ho mm -hmm. but mi fa obi mm -hmm. i say the chef food said high cap manager eh uh, manager mm -hmm. but boss pa no ho i said managing director now say managing director yes yeah exactly no wafa obi so as a manager mm -hmm. uh, or chef or managing or affairs, managing affairs yeah. no and you know oba wo ho say obe to be ma fo mm -hmm. Bemana who are the bath form or banner be my bearman who are then so. Bemano a year encouragement or bano is there to encourage the man. Sometimes, believe me, Bemma Bebe feel now why so discouraged. It doesn't matter how strong a man is. Sometimes, you know, be a human may be BSC. Now, why so down or be fear or banner or encouraging them? A banner set or tune for all honey, a bay a year. Oh, where they say, Mamma, oh, that, oh, that's so I get here. You gave me okay. And so, Oba, your advisor. So, Oba, shall not bear my head now on two SEC for ye. Um, um, my own say, oh, may say two words. Me per se, ye yet clear. The four words, no, I yet clear. I will honor. Okay. Uh, oh, you so the word, uh, advisor. Mm -hmm. Anna, who you sue the word someone who encourages? Anna, oh my example, we say, uh, Bermano is like on the owner of a company. Exactly. Anna, the manager, no. Mm -hmm. Uh, me say, uh, say the manager, no. Need you any say, or be manager, or be your focus on a human. The, uh, he, the owner, not the, the man, mm. not to advise him. But you, but you, but you, but say, you have to say, say, if I have a company, let's say, uh, telecom company, mm. you were in a, in a company, you know, you were, uh, your friend is a sales ma uh, he, uh, department, mm. you were, if you are, uh, he, uh, um, what again, you were, uh, but you need the, uh, accountant, accounting department, yeah. you want different, different kinds mm -hmm. of department. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, the, uh, the manager no, is supposed to say, Obe manage sa area. Ho. Okay. Now, no, no, the mm -hmm. affair no, uh, yeah, the uh, mm -hmm. but in your managing director, no, right. and obey focus on so mm -hmm. or focus on the assignment in a managing director, no, and uh, rather, and your man, but I saw, okay. Yeah, yeah, we're going to mix it. 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 So we're going to mix the local dialect and also the English. <laughs> uh, Papa, I'm saying that because mm -hmm. you ask her, what is the duty of the woman? Yes. Mm -hmm. And as a woman in the house, say, who can be fear? Doesn't matter whether you be the boss or the overall boss. Yeah. You know, say, the countenance is not good. Uh. Mm -hmm. You as a woman should be in the position to, to, to let the man feel at home. Yeah. To let him feel the French to let be in. To let him feel comfortable. Because the Ufi, Ufi are going to be feeling that way so down. That the very the person of being to encourage you no, and your wife. So yeah. that means that means it's words of encouragement. Exactly. Uh, uh, so it is not it, the, that, that is why I said mm. you uh -huh. said you uh, uh, it's different from advising somebody. Oh is that advice some, sometimes okay. so, sometimes mm. you know. Ebia u ukuno abefi talking about marriage u kuna befi adibu wa eche na bienso ebia na unia damphobia adamphobia na foka to if the friend is not even a Christian can be a worldly friend but the husband has to share with the wife first yeah and the wife can also advise the husband yeah honey can can but the word that we use here say the the wife is the advisor. She is an advisor to yeah. the husband. And, and sometimes it can be. You, you are saying sometimes. Yes. But uh, you, you see, words are powerful. So yeah. we, should, we should mind the way we use our wife, words. Wife can that, advise that men. Can. Even not can. Wife must advise. Wife must advise. Advise the wife. Advise the wife. 
the Bible is saying so that, 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 that means when, that means the man the man the, 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 they cannot advise themselves. Of course they you can. can advise yourself. Sure. Princess, let me say yeah. this. If men they are growing, they are the mm. heck. Mm. If yeah. men they are growing after 50, 55, they are don't care. They think that I'm married, have my wife, have my kids. Okay, now. So the wife has to take control no, over everything. They don't even care. And sometimes some women even don't see mm. to help their husbands. Oh, honey, you are going, you are going out. We, we, we are tired in, in, in the color of the shirt. Or oh, maybe, honey, I got this cream. Your skin is so dry. The men will don't, they don't even take notice. Mm. They know it's, I'm, I'm the head, I have money, I'm thinking of my wife. And so sometimes they don't even care for their, their, their skin. skin. Their yeah. welfare, their, their well being. Mm -hmm. A woman, you are there to make sure say, the king is going out. Mm -hmm. Or why until why people will stand by and look at you and say, Yeah, this is this is really a married man. That is it. If a man is not married, that he doesn't you go out not, not closing the, the, the zip. Yeah. Or sometimes leave it there. Sometimes the, 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 the colour is, not, the color all is not well turned. Sometimes yeah. it's dirty. Yeah. Who will look mm -hmm. at it for mm -hmm. you? Mm -hmm. And so woman, you are there to advise your husband, yeah. please. And, and listen, this, the layout principle for marriage is not the same layout principle when you go to work. When you when you are at a workplace, uh, your boss is your boss. Maybe you cannot advise your boss. But that side is for work. It's just for business yes. layout. But you cannot compare that principles when you come to your marriage. Mm -hmm. Because the marriage is... It's for the two of you, you become one. It's only in the Bible that we know that one plus one is the same one. But when you go to school, they tell us that one plus one is now two. Hmm. You understand it? The woman is formed out of the man. The God took a rib from the man, covered the, it. The advisor from the man. That is it. So he covered the rib and then he gave it to Adam. And Adam said, this is my bone. You understand it? Mm -hmm. And this is the flesh of my flesh and mm -hmm. the bone of my bone, which means this is you, uh, with the woman, me. yeah, the woman, I am now complete. You mm -hmm. understand it? It's like when one shoe is lost and somebody comes in and says, this is the other pair of the shoes. Mm -hmm. Do you treat the other pair of the shoes as, an, as somebody who is an intruder? No. It makes the pair of the shoe now complete. As such, is marriage. With a woman in your life you, now, Joseph Kwame Anna is saying something that mm. the woman mm. is a backbone, and it's true. Yeah, the woman is the backbone of the man. Yes, because if the backbone mm. is not is fractured and mm. has a backbone, mm. a, 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 a tristia, yeah, the man cannot stand. You are incomplete. You are incomplete without the woman. So. But, but that's why that's why we are saying that we can advise. Of course. Because um, listen, as a man, the person who can actually even advise you most is your, it's wife. your wife. When we talk about uh, a backbone, mm -hmm. it means that there's somebody who supports you. Yeah, your backbone. In, yeah. Some some the one who supports mm -hmm. you in what you are doing. That so that way. means the man is the vision career. Yes. Yeah. And the woman is supporting the man for the vision to come to pass. Yes. yes. Do we agree on this? Oh, yeah, I agree. Yes, 100%. Okay, good. So we, we move on. Yes. Because I just wanted to draw, draw the foundation uh, the, the, the foundation so that we can build upon it. Okay. Um, Mama or Lady Rita, how does marriage work in general? How does ma marriage work in general? Wow, that's a very What is the, the general principle for marriage mm. according to the word of God? According to the word of God, woman submits. When the woman knows her position that I have to be submissive to my husband, then your husband will love you. Listen, that is what the Bible has laid out. When these two ingredients are working, the food is going to be very tasty. The marriage is going to be very yummy. Listen, most of the times, the woman will rather want to love the man. Leaving the submission for the man rather to submit. So that is where we normally complain. But I love him. But I do everything for him. 
that but my husband, when I sometimes they say, my husband does not help me, my husband does not listen to me. Listen, it is for we the women rather to take the instruction. That will make you to be submissive. And then when you have been submissive, your husband will love you. Our own way of loving our husband is the submissiveness. When you are submissive, it's your form of loving. Because that is what the Bible has taught us to do. And when these two ingredients are working, you wouldn't have any complaint. Even when you want to criticize something, maybe your husband has done something, he's doing something that you think is not right. You really want to put him back on track. You do that with submissiveness. You have to be submissive in correcting him. Submissive in everything. Even when you think what he's doing, you want to say no. You say it with, with submissive, uh, 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 with humbleness. Amen. 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 And then by so doing, your husband will also love you. It works automatically. Before, I was also having that problem. When I started applying the Bible, that is why now I'm so bold in speaking about it because practically, mm. practically, mm. I've also experienced it and now it's working for me beautifully. Mm. Let me, let me uh, check my viewers. And, um, Joseph Kwame Annan it says, God, good, uh, good evening to you all. Good evening, Joseph, my dear Joseph. Good evening. Uh, we need your contribution. We need your advice. We need your ideas. Uh, please, you can send your ideas through uh, this media, this platform, and we will answer it. Angelina Sewa, Angela Sewa, uh, she says, nice to listen to you in English for everyone to understand. Joseph Kwame Annan, again, the woman is the backbone of the man, as he said. Is that a woman? Woman, every woman is the backbone. That is, you are the supporter. You support the man from falling. Uh, amen. Chris Nakon says, God bless you. God bless you, our dear sister. God bless you. God bless you. Uh, Mama. Papa. In Africa, how is or how does the marriage works hmm. in africa those days years ago before 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 now you see the man will work as a breadwinner and the woman will maybe do petty trade and so the woman is more or less at home early before the man comes and so the woman will serve the man and then the woman will take care of the house, make sure everything is tip top, everything is clean. And but now the women are also into um, work. Some even work more hours than the men. And so some also because of that they have also hired uh, um, house, house help, help. Yeah. Yes. House to house. help them relieve some of the stress upon yes. them yes and so formally uh, you see the men eating the woman will just you know sort of turn a corner yeah. nicely the man will have a singlet on his shoulders and then make sure <laughs> after eating you put the, the table and the woman will come and take it mm -hmm. you know but now um it is not like that anymore because mm -hmm. the women most of them are working mm -hmm. to support the man and okay. so they have also maybe gotten people that they, they will support. Maybe you have somebody in the village who uh, you really want to help. Mm. So it is hand go hand come. Mm. She will come and live with you, maybe help support you with the other things. Yeah. If you have children, mm. also help with the children because both of you will be working. Yeah. Amen. Let me take some uh, comments here. Uh, we have uh, Joseph Kwame Annan. He says, uh, when you are single, people don't respect you. When you get married, that is when you see respect, people respect you. So he's encouraging each and every one, when you are due, get married. Get married. Get married. Get married. Get married. Get it's not from me, it's Joseph Kwame Annan. Yeah. <laughs> Amen. Thank you, my brother. Joseph, you are right. <laughs> and we have uh, Bishop Collins Dubuahi. He says, what is the meaning of a helper? What has she come to help? Wow. What is the meaning of a helper and what has she come to help? We will answer this question before then. Well, let's go to uh, 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 Joseph Kwame Annan. He said, I love this program. Thank you for loving this program. Continue to love the, our program. God bless you. 
And then uh, Bishop Colin said, Do boy insists, I love this program. We love you also. Amen. He Amen. says, More grace, more grace, more Amen. grace. Amen. And we are having Louis Najer, Bishop Collins, and Dubois, and others are watching Nana Dumante, Course of, uh, course of Kinder Hill. Ah. <laughs> Nana. So I think they want us to start eating on their problems. Why Nana, they? <laughs> we, we, will, we will come back to you. We will, we, will surely, we will surely hit that area. And we are moving step from step, step by step. Amen. Amen. Um, Daddy asked the question there. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, who is a helper? Mm. Uh, one thing I know is a helper is somebody, I wouldn't use the same word, who comes to help. Mm. We need to explain the meaning of help. Um, I'll just make a little illustration here. Like now, I want to build a mansion. Okay? I need a huge capital. Now, the money that I have is not adequate for me to start up this mansion. Mm -hmm. Here comes somebody who said, well, I can volunteer, uh, volunteer or I guarantee a loan for you, mm -hmm. you know, to enable you to get this capital that you need, you need to start up this project you want to take on. Mm -hmm. This person becomes your help. That person came in as a, 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 a God saint to make a way when there seems to be no way. Mm -hmm. yeah. Make the vision that you thought, how can I get there? Because maybe your source of strength was very little. Your knowledge was very faint. Here comes somebody that God bring this person in your life. To enable you get to your destination at the right time. Such a person is your helper. Without that person, you would have been still marking time on the same place that you were. It's like you are in school now. Your parents are dead. You are alone. You need somebody to sponsor your education. Here comes an, a company. Calls you in from a nowhere and said, we really want to step in as a parent for you to enable you to complete your education. They are your helper. So for women to become helpers, which means we are in to enable your vision to be accomplished. To enable you build that perfect future God has planned for you. <laughs> to enable you to become whom God has designed your life to be. So that is why we are called the helpers. Mommy, maybe you, maybe you want to say something. You want to add something to Oh, as a helper. Yeah, just add something. Yeah. yeah. As a helper, you are like an assistant. Mm -hmm. You are like a secretary. Mm. You are like an adjutant. Mm. You do most a lot of things. Mm. Most a lot of things. Mm. And so if we say a helper, a helper is somebody who has to be there for that person you are helping to feel comfortable. Mm. You are not just there to criticize. Mm. You are there to make him feel comfortable. Mm. Like, like a secretary in an office. Yeah. Or an adjutant. You do things for mm. uh, whosoever you are there to help. And yeah. if you say women are helping, that means women should, should know our position. That the men have something they are doing. Yeah. And then God has brought us into their life to support and help them. Not to bring them down. Yeah. But to enable them go higher and exactly. higher. So that they can achieve. They can achieve, achieve their, their purpose. Their purpose. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. So the, are you trying to say that it is the man who has the vision? Yeah. And the woman is supporting mm -hmm. the vision to come to pass? Yes. Okay. 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 So that is the role that women play mm. in marriage. In marriage. Okay. Yes. Mm. Because let me say something later here. In Genesis 2, the verse, <clears throat> yeah, um, Genesis chapter 2 and verse um, 18, or no, maybe, yeah, maybe you can take it from 20. Uh, from 18. Yeah, the 18 is good. Okay. Mm -hmm. said, and the Lord God said, it is not good that the man should be alone. Mm. I will make him and help. 
made for him. And the 19, and out of the ground, the Lord formed every beast of the field and every fowl of the air and brought them into Adam to see what he could call them. And mm -hmm. whatsoever Adam called the living creature, that was the name therefore. Mommy, wait 20. There. Mommy, wait there. Which means Adam had a vision. Because God gave him a work. Yeah, he was the one who was naming all the creatures. Mm -hmm. yeah. And Bible said, whatever name Adam gave, so it has been to, the, to now. You know? So which means, and mommy, before you even came to the 9, to the 18, my version <clears throat> is saying the B part, I will make a helper who is just right for him. <laughs> who is just right. right. Mm -hmm. So we can have helpers that are not right. Of course, there are some helpers that just come to pull you down. They will uh, put the ladder out of the way. Okay. For you to help for. A helper should mm. be like your, your opposite. Yeah. Mm. The opposite of you. Who will see, I see you, I see me myself. Mm -hmm. So if I'm hurting you, I'm hurting myself. Mm -hmm. But sometimes, uh, certain helpers, they, are, they don't have the feeling that they are hurting you. So yeah. that means they are not, they are not right. They are not the right helpers. helpers. And every helper so we have, has to have the, the right issue. helpers. And then we have the wrong okay. helpers. People will come to you that uh, they want to help you, but not all of them will really help you. Mm -hmm. Some are coming to take from you, yeah, and exactly. some are really coming to help you. Yeah. So it is up to you to differentiate the two, mm -hmm. to know the right one to take, mm -hmm. so that you will be able to fulfill your giving purpose on this earth. Yes. Oh, good. Um, let's come to Europe. Yeah. How do you see Europe mm -hmm. marriages? Mommy, this one you will talk later. <laughs> How do you see Europe marriages? Mm -hmm. Papa, let me read something from the same Genesis chapter 2. Okay. Okay. Let me go down. Okay. down. Uh, okay, the 24. The mm -hmm. Genesis chapter 2, verse 24. Mm -hmm. Therefore, a man shall leave his father and his mother and shall cleave unto his wife, and they shall be one flesh. And they were both naked, the man and his wife, mm. and they were not ashamed. Yeah. There was total transparency. Mm. But these days in Europe, married, mm. you, you don't have transparency. <clears throat> what am I saying? That sometimes mm. you are weak, mm. and then you, you, you meet your partner. Mm. Be transparent. Let the person know that, okay, I'm weak. Sometimes, this is my weakness. I, I sometimes get angry. Mm. I'm, some, I'm sometimes, you know, get irritated. I'm some transparency. Mm. But because we are not transparent, if the person do something, then it's like, mm. wow, um, it irritates you. This is this is this is uncalled for. How should why should you do this? Mm. And because we too, we don't say tell the the, the, the the our partners, our husbands, or that this is this is me. Sometimes mm. I do this. Sometimes mm. there's no total transparency. Mm. Sometimes you show that you are there, but you are not there. No truthfulness. There's no exactly. No There's no truthfulness. Mm -hmm. There's no transparency. Mm -hmm. Because you know that if I tell the man that uh, maybe I wrote something that sometimes you have fear, mm -hmm. you have fear of the future. Mm -hmm. Explain to your partner, honey. Sometimes I have this fear mm -hmm. what the future holds for us. Mm -hmm. But you pretend that you are you are a boy, you can handle everything. And then out of nowhere, something come up and it's like you cannot stay, you want to leave the relationship. Job again for this. Exactly. Yeah. You see, so um we have to be transparent to each other. Mm. I mean, if the man or woman loves you, it doesn't matter uh, uh, your shortcomings, it doesn't matter uh, how weak you are. Mm. If that person loves you, the person can still be with you yeah. and help you to stand. Yeah. And give me the strength that you need. We lack transparency. We lack it. Either we are afraid, or other we want to show that yes, we can. Mm. But sometimes we need you need that partner of you for you to be able to stand. Um, uh, Bishop Collins uh asked a question. Uh, after he I did ask who is a helper, mm. and then he asked that what have they come to what help. And, and, I and then, yeah, you, yeah. Uh, we, you did explain it. Um, I want to ask a question in that, in that angle. Uh, my question is, do women, when they enter into the marriage, find out, one, the vision of the man, and in which way they can help? Or do they just enter into it 
and then they do their own thing. <coughs> because they are there, they are the backbone to support what the main body is doing. So when they come, do they support their own thing? What is the main the main body doing? Do they even find out what the main body is doing? Because we see uh, it's like uh, this is mine, this is yours mm. in marriages, mm. yeah. and and uh, and it is the man who married the woman into the house, so that the woman will help him in his vision. Mm. But before he knows it, it's a different story. It's a different ballgame altogether. Mm. So I am asking this question. Do women, when they go into marriages, ask the vision career what the vision is because they are there to help? Mm -hmm. So what am I supposed to do? Or do they do their own thing? Mm -hmm. What a question. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Uh, Prophet, you know, uh, before, when I became born again, I didn't know all this. Yes. Yeah. I read the scriptures. Mm -hmm. And... Um, and let me chip in this. I fell in love with uh, one pastor, mm. and uh, my aim was to marry a pastor. Mm. He should pray for me, mm. even when I'm eating. Mm. He should bless my food. Mm. I mean, I would do nothing. It was about you, you, you. About you. me, me, me. <laughs> so, hey, I've gotten a pastor, you mm. know. And then the pastor also said that, yeah, I can't marry you because one, you can't speak English. And two, you don't even know what is called meditation. He even mm. asked me, what is meditation? I said, me, I don't know anything. In like, like, so that means you cannot help him. I cannot help him. Mm -hmm. And then he asked me, what is your vision? I said, me, I only see vision when I sleep. <laughs> and today, if I think about it, I say, God, what do you mean? You, you were saying what you knew. I and guess, yes, that is time. And, and then the man said, no, then I, I come to marry you. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. And he just left. And so I took time and scrutinized the word of God. And I yeah. realized that I'm a helpmate. Mm. Mm. I'm a helpmate. Mm. And so, and, and some women are like me when I was uh, not strong in the Lord. They, they don't also know that they, they are they are helpmates. Mm. A lot of women don't know. A lot of women, they don't know. Like I didn't know. I thought that the man should uh, give me money to do this. The man should do that. The man should do everything. Ma is maybe to maybe cook mm. sometimes mm. and maybe sleep with him. Mm. That's it. Mm. I didn't know that even I had to be praying for my husband. Mm. And so when God blessed me with my husband, I realized that they, they, they have a, a work to do. Yeah. And God also prepared me to be able to be a helpmate for him. Yeah. So there are other women who don't even know that they are helpmates. Yeah. I didn't know. So that is where the problem is coming from. They should read the Bible. That is where the problem is coming yeah. from. Mm -hmm. I didn't know. And how can I pray if I yeah. pray if I pastor? Because the Bible says can can they can two, two work together, together unless, unless they agree. Unless they but agree. if you are coming in with your own vision mm -hmm. and I'm also in with my own vision, mm -hmm. then how can we work together? The most painful part is when a woman comes into a man's life just because he wants the woman, the man rather to be a helper to her. Yeah, that is what they say. To enable her. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Sorry, Sorry for the technical uh, problem. Yeah, some, some don't know. They don't know. That's the most painful part is um, when a woman doesn't know her position in the marriage, she even go there to rub shoulders with the man. Oh, yes. Competition. Mm -hmm. You understand it? Yeah. And in Europe here, we can mention like millions why reason why marriages collapse because here in Europe, the vision is different from that of Africa. Maybe I'm homeless. I need a man to just shelter me. So I'll go in as a wife, mm -hmm. just for shelter. Mm -hmm. Somebody will also go because of So I gather what I want to gather. That yes. is it. Yes. Somebody will only go because of turbulence. Mm -hmm. Some only go because of... A lot. A lot. Millions. Mm -hmm. I'm the breadwinner and I have to take off my mother in Ghana, yeah, my father, so my siblings. I don't care about your vision. Yeah. So me, I don't care about the vision. Yeah. Mine is I work, I hide the money somewhere, yeah. or I take it to Africa. And that is why some marriages 
They are not standing. I want somebody to bring me to Europe so I'll get married to a burger. Yes. There are thousands of reasons why. So the main purpose of getting married is somewhere and then we have picked something else mm. to become the marriage mm. vision. Mm. And that is why we are seeing broken, broken marriages, marriages in, yes. in, in Europe. A lot, a lot, a ah. lot, a lot. Oh. They don't, there's no sacrifice. Mommy, to talk about this sacrifice, mm. dear, there's another, this is another topic for another day. Oh. Uh, somebody excuse me, somebody <laughs> asked a question about Kindergirl. Mm. Um, how, how, yeah, how would you uh, connect this uh, child's benefit with uh, a wife being a helper and a vision career? How mm. how do we connect this these three things? Uh, Papa, what I would say is in Ghana, do we have kindergarten? No, we don't have it. Okay, mm. it's very important. So if you are here, you are privileged to get this money. It is not for you. Mm. Yeah. Because the kids are going like they are traveling, mm. yeah. you buy this, you buy that. The camping fee. The yeah, camping fee, yeah. the, the whatever it's they really going to be very expensive. Yeah. And also, as they are growing, mm. we have summer, we have autumn, we have winter. Mm. That yeah, dress, spring. spring, that dress you bought last year, this oh. year that child cannot, cannot yeah, wear. They, they are growing every day. My, my son is 16, he's taller than me. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, and if you buy something, you buy also big. He doesn't want big. Mm. He wants, he wants the skin, skin skin tight. Tight. Skin tight. Skin tight. And if it's a little bit longer, you know that, oh, you can, you can wear it next year. No, 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 no. no. The same level. The same, same height. You see, so the next year, you have to buy they it. They even want markets. They want markets. Yeah. Mm. And you will take picture. Marker. Mm. Designer. And yeah. you send it to you that, I saw this. Mm. It's a snake. Uh, yeah, mm. can you buy it? Mm -hmm. You see, and so this cannot give is there to support the children. That's all. Yeah. Support. This is not That's for to the help. mother to help. To help. Because they know that winter, the things, the child cannot wait in summer. Yeah. In summer, you cannot wear the things in winter. Mm. Because as mothers in Ghana, we don't have uh, this children benefits. We don't have to fight over it. Do you know that even the Germans don't know that this is causing problems in marriage? If they got to do, they will stop they it. They will stop it. That's what I said all that time. You they will, will stop. They will use an advantage to stop it. Yeah, they will stop. You see, so we have to think to us and do that this money is for my child. Hmm. The child will grow. He will go to driving school. The child will grow. He will do job courses. You have to pay it yourself. You can even save some, like maybe 50, 50 euro. When a child is 16 years and then you tell him, exactly. this is what I've saved out you. of your child's benefit. Use it to do something. Start something. Yeah, driving you know, license. A driving license yeah, and some yeah. courses that you would do. Yeah, yeah. This, 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 that you don't, don't pay. You have to pay it yourself. Yeah, you to pay. And so the benefit is not for a man and for the woman. Some men even if they divorce your yeah, wife right, because of killer guilt. Yeah. Yeah, because, yeah. But my question is, uh, my question is, uh, I want us to focus on my question. My question is, uh, we are talking about uh, the fishing career and, the, and then the helper, mm -hmm. the, the main body and then the backbone. Mm -hmm. And then somebody comes in to give you money, uh, just a, 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 a gift to your, your, your daughter or to your son. Mm -hmm. um, where does this money go? How do you handle this money? It goes to the two of us, the man and the woman. Mm -hmm. We sit down and then we talk about this money. What are we? Where do we actually need help most in a in, in a kid's in life? The life of our family. You know, maybe there's maybe the child's academics is even not too good. He needs not even, He needs an assistant, extra teacher who will take him for extra classes. And this money, euro a month. yeah, this money you can rather use it to enable the child acquire more knowledge in education. You don't fight over it. Mm -mm. That money is not for only one person. It's neither for the woman, neither is it for the man. The, the name of the money has even already been entitled child's benefit. If the child is capable and competent, he will rather tell you what he wants or she wants that money to be used for because that is the child's money. And when you're not working as a, as, a, as, as a mother, you have your own benefit you are receiving. As a, as a, as a, a, a man who is not also working, we have also your benefit that you receive. We have abide laws, guilt. And then we have also the, the, the one that they give for the mutter. So I don't know why they only circle on the child because the child is helpless. He does not know what our uh, my mommy and daddy, they are killing 
themselves over because of that a lot of broken marriages. Kids are living without with, without their father love, and it's it's, 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 it's such a pity. Um, such a pity. Uh, Bishop, uh, Bishop, <laughs> Bishop. <laughs> <laughs> we're senior. Your words are really powerful. You <laughs> see me. The, the, the first here. one you saw the me. I, 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 I jumped over it, and now he has brought another one again. <laughs> campion, yes. com, campion, uh, parasitic campion. Uh, you, you, you saw the first one, and I, I, I said a little bit of it, then I jumped, and now there's another one. He's not okay. 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 He's not <laughs> um, I, I just want to ask something. I just want to ask something. <laughs> yes, it's true. It's, it's true. When, when I, I want us to go back a little bit. Mm -hmm. When a woman decides to marry or accept a proposal from a man to marry, uh, do do does she um? Think about the vision of the man before she enters into the marriage. <laughs> that, that she sees that her, her vision is, is, is equal to or is the same as or her vision fit in the man's vision before she enters in or she just enters in. And let me wait. If I want to ask and another what, question then, do we even ask what the vision is? We only think about the feelings. Yeah. And then before maybe you attach yourself to somebody, you've already studied the person. Maybe the person has document, the person has a home, the person has a beautiful house, the person has a car, the person what what bread to baby into no way they may make a warena membre when you debit the baby yeah yeah. The future is secured, you know. Mm -hmm. We don't even ask about your vision. No. Because if I should ask about your vision, that is where I can even ask myself, hey, maybe. To be uh, uh, to marry like mommy, getting married to a uh, bishop. Yeah, pastor. Yeah, pastor. You know, bishop. it's not just a little, a uh, small title. There's a lot that is required for you yeah. as a wife, standing in front of people, educating them, preaching about the word of God. Do you have all that it takes to be a wife? You know, mommy, to to marry a doctor. Yeah, You'll be sharing it. your husband yeah, with patients every time. In the night, in the they can night call him. Yeah. Yeah. You know, so are you prepared for that? Is your vision that is it? That's your vision fit in marrying uh, 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 somebody who is a military uh, person. Yeah, mm -hmm. he can die at any time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, we don't ask questions seriously. We, it's either about the beauty you are being attracted by the guy's beauty, or maybe the lady's shape. We are attracted by the material things that the person has been able to acquire by the grace of God. We don't ask the question, Papa. Do we even ask? And because of this problem, our children are also find the same, they're also in the same situation. Mm -hmm. One time I was asking a young man, he came to our workplace and I was asking him. He said he's fed that he doesn't want to do the job again. This is a straight time entry into a training course. Mm -hmm. He went, went into the first one, then later he realized that that is a wrong course for him. He entered into the second one, he realized it's the wrong course. So that means all the two he did not finish. And this one too he did not finish. It left. It has no even no because then I said, listen, before you enter into, let's say, so if you want to, let's say, if you want to work as a supermarket, as a worker, saleswoman, oh. as a worker, you have to know that Saturdays you work. Yes. You have to know that you have double shift. Mm -hmm. You have to think about all this is like, a, okay, let's say, like a, 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 a doctor. You go to hospital, you go to work on Sundays. Mm -hmm. So if you are a person who does not want to work on weekends, then you shouldn't be, you shouldn't take this course. Exactly. That is not for you because a doctor, you are all weather. Exactly. A policeman, you are all weather. Exactly. exactly. So you have to know the course that you want to take so that you, then you ask yourself, am I, am I prepared to prepare for this course? Uh, this course, is this course good for me? Do I want my life to become like this? Because a doctor will leave you most of the time in the night. Yes. Yeah. It's true. Mm. So, you know, so when we marry wrong person, our minds are what, different. different. And that is when, um, as uh, my mother said, 
That is when the woman of God says, me to me, I have a vision. Mm -hmm. Instead of he, she supporting the man's vision, mm -hmm. yeah. then they become two. That mm -hmm. is a two vision. And if it, if it becomes is, two, yeah. then it is, yeah, a, a, a divorce will come. Yeah. Because the vision, the D, mm -hmm. is that it's for two. Mm -hmm. And so if you have a vision, or me to also have a vision, yeah. by the time you realize, the woman wants to also, you know, be, sh be known, and then, the you know, like a competition. Yeah. yeah. And then, make, then at the end of the day, will come divorce. Mm. Because the man is the vision career, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and the woman is supposed to be the helpmate mm -hmm. to help and support the man. Mm -hmm. But the, the vision woman, to come to pass. Exactly. And if it comes to pass, it's what you cover you, the woman. That is well. it. It is yours. It is yours. Mm -hmm. But you see some woman trying to like, like uh, me to have family, me to have uh, this. Yes. Me, and, and so they try to hide things from the man. Yeah. Try to hide having money, their own vision. Having their own, their own vision. Yeah. Because when I'm traveling, when I'm coming from Africa, I was being advised that mm -hmm. a, a man is not a pillow. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So you end up hiding money mm -hmm. and hiding money. But sometimes, if care is not taken, you mm -hmm. die. And then when you go under your bed, you see millions of euros under your bed. Mm -hmm. uh, bishop, 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 <laughs> he said, uh, check the word vision. Mm -hmm. Very well, very, very check the uh, vision very well. That's the word vision. Okay. Very well. Uh, it says that there's a difference between vision and division. Mm. <laughs> mm. Mm. Ah, okay, division means two. Yeah. 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 Vision, half of vision, mm. and division. division. Mm. And so he is trying to say that I think he is trying to say that uh, uh, some come in because of the vision and some come in to divide. Mm. Mm. Right. Yes. As we were saying now. Mm. They bring division. Majesty, God bless you. <laughs> Amen. So now let's enter into the solution. People are itching. People are itching to hear. What should we do? How should our marriage go? How can we experience sweetness, goodness? Love, understanding, togetherness in marriage. How can I have a good marriage? Now, this is the question. Mama, uh, Lady Rita. Mm. Um, I will humbly say, unless you are two, you cannot speak one language. Mm -hmm. uh, and Bible has already stated it. When two people, they make their mind one. There is nothing they cannot achieve. Before you can get somebody to somebody, you have to first and foremost know where you are standing. Are you a Christian? Are you a born again Christian? Then which means, even we have this old added that says that uh, two birds of the same feathers, they flock together. And no more mutakra eseno, and no butu ebo. Good, you are a Christian. So why don't you marry somebody who is also a Christian? A God-fearing person. So when you find a partner who is also a God-fearing person. I like the word God-fearing person, not Christian. Yeah, but a God-fearing person. Then the two of you, Mumu said, Mukra, the same faith. So one, the Bible is going to be your guidelines to guide Mumu and Mumu now. How are we to me up. Then you ask the person, communication. Find out the vision. Ask the person, say na ne vision eti and I say e ni so adie ba ne wo ne so for the marriage. You are coming together uh, for what purpose? Mm -hmm. Because God say, brought I love Adam. You, I, love you, I love you. I love you. Yeah. <laughs> As a helper, it is. Uh, only ne she ame. When you come, well, or maybe when you meet a partner, you have to talk about more, 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 more future. How do you want the future to be? Upon which? Vision and a moon person was started to an so that I, being the wife, I will know my place. I'm meeting me, may the helper to you because if I don't know your vision, I cannot be a, a helper to you. And when you two you don't have a vision, then which means you don't need a helper. Hmm. If you have, you, you, uh, <laughs> <laughs> when if, if you are just working on this earth with no vision. You cannot carry somebody along and complicate a person's life. Because when you come with somebody who has all the strength, the power, who has all that it takes to be a helper, 
And then he said that you are wasting my strength. You are wasting my resources. I'm not being fruitful. I'm not being effective in your life. He or she would rather want to give you a vision, which may not correspond with yours. Mm -hmm. So if you don't want somebody to come and give you a vision, mm -hmm. please search for the purpose of you being on this earth. Everybody has an aim on this earth. Exactly. And that aim has to be accomplished. Mm -hmm. That is why God has given you grace. And you are still moving. So please, you have to know why you are on earth. Then you can ask your wife or the person that you are bringing in as your life partner. Please, this is my vision. I'm called as a as a as a, a pastor. I'm called as a carpenter. I'm called as a teacher. I'm called as a doctor. I'm called as what well, you must have a, something doing in life. And then you ask your partner, can can you be a helper in my life to enable this vision come to pass? Please, women, be sincere with you. If you know you don't have that strength. Don't go there because of the material things you think the guy has, has. or maybe because uh, the fame, or maybe because of uh, your time is ticking, the clock is moving, all your, your friends are getting married. You also need to get married. That is why most of the time you enter, it will last like two weeks, the marriage is eaten on the rocks already. It's as if you could laugh before you say, yes, I do. You know? So please, you have to always, before you go into somebody's life, ask yourself, do I find myself in this? You have to be compatible. You have to be uh, 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 speak of one Best language. Best of the same feathers. Mm -hmm. Because if you don't have that, if you don't have that power or that strength, you cannot be a helper to the person. You will go there. You, you want to build your own future. You will say marriage is not the end of it. I, I have also a future I have to build. Mm -hmm. Is that what the Bible said? Then we think there is no more two. There is no more oh, one. Wow. Sorry, but now it is two. You are building your future. Your husband is building his future. So who is the helper? Then become division. Yeah. Become division. And then comes divorce. Yeah. And then there will be divorce. Yeah. Your husband will think that you are not a helper. You are not being submissive. But because you have your own vision, you cannot be submissive to the man's authority because you want, you want to focus on your life and build it. You don't have time for your husband. If he cannot move on, then that is your, that is your man's own problem. You know, so please, we have to be faith, faithful to ourselves, truthful to ourselves. Don't go and complicate somebody's life for him. You yourself, too, don't go and mess up. Because it's not good to say, we for marriage, now you divorce so. It's a bad mark on you. It's not good for you. And so let our life in Koto Chacha because of, I don't know, whatever reason you have. And when you go there, please, please, massage and I'm telling you, if you don't have the gift of submissiveness, pray about it. When the Spirit of God gives you the submissiveness, you enjoy your marriage, eh? It's sweet, eh? <laughs> Amen. So let's pray for it so that we can enjoy our marriage. Amen. Amen. Let's uh, this many as well. Uh, okay. Uh, cosmos, greatness. Uh, Nanaki Safu, uh, thanks for watching this program. Uh, Mama, in fact, before Mama Meba also, in fact, uh, what Mama, the age, uh, and uh, for us to talk about uh, men complicating uh, uh, a woman's life, mm. and uh, women so, so messing up men's life. Uh, uh, you give me the age, I said, the next topic uh, we should talk about men. Yeah. Men. And then the next time we talk about women, <laughs> we talk about no, we, we, we talk about men, mm. what they are supposed to, they are supposed to be, mm. who they are, mm. and the right the right man, okay. who is the right man, mm. a real man, a real man. Mm. the right man must have a vision. Mm. So uh, uh, you give me that edge, mm. and uh, a, a, a woman, mm. you should know. You should know the vision of a man. Mm. So I want us to, we will talk about it. I want us to talk about it next week, if God permits. Mm. Mama, what would you say? What do you have to say? Um, what I would say, sometimes you, know, you, you will meet a man and sometimes you, you will look at the outward like material things. Okay. Even if the person is a pastor, it will not happen overnight. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. That is why we have courtship, we have uh, dating and then courtship. Yeah. yeah. So in the cost of it, you will know, say, 
This man has a vision. Yeah. And am I ready to support him? Mm -hmm. Am I ready to tolerate whatever comes along with the package? Mm. And sometimes, you know, like you'll be given a prophecy, or oh, you marry a man of God. Mm. So every man of God, you are looking at him to propose to you. Mm. Every man of God, if you go, if you go to church, mm. you don't see the word of God. You are just look, looking at the man of God ah, and then asking, is he married? Is, is he, he not married? <laughs> and, and, and then you end up fornicating, jumping to bed with somebody by the name of a person. So we, we don't want to, if you know that you are a helper, you, you will help that person so that vision will come to pass. Yes. Mm. And you, oh. you have to suffer. Mm. You have to endure, mm. persevere, mm. so that that vision will surely come to pass. Mm. But if you go there looking for uh, material things, looking for ready-made pastor, a ready-made man of God, mm. a ready-made businessman, a ready-made uh, accountant, then you might end up, you know, uh, destroying that man's vision. Because you are there to help. Mm. You are there to support. Mm. You are there because sometimes you give the prophets, oh, I see you marrying a pastor. Mm. Immediately you heard the word pastor. You go to church and every pastor you are chasing the yeah, man. Yeah, and you end up sleeping with every man of God. Yeah. And later you say the man of God, they are fake. They will sleep with the girls. It is the girls who go there because they have prophecy. Yeah. So they want to seduce them. And you cannot hide a, 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 a fire in your bosom and it will not burn you. It will definitely burn you. Because, because you've been given a prophecy, fire. you will marry a pastor. If you see every man in Kerika, you look and go, <laughs> and why it is pulling up, pulling up, pulling, pulling up. And at the end of the day, the man will sleep with you. Yeah. And when he finish, he will say you are a witch. Mm. You have caused him to fall. Yeah. And so you will go looking after somebody who he will not fall. Yeah. And you end up being hopeless, sorry. Mm. You see, so some you have to know why am I being a helpmate? Mm. How am I going to even use this mm. virtue as a helpmate to mm. help it maybe this man? Mm. Because if you are helpmate, you have to know that you have to help him even to stand. Mm. You don't help him to fall. Mm. And because there's a prophecy, you marry a pastor, then every man in clerical has to fall. Mm. And so we also have to be ready as a woman or helpmate mm. to also sacrifice, mm. to suffer with them. Mm. So a, a time will come that you will see that that man will be going up. Then you will also stand beside him. Yeah. Yeah. But mostly some don't want to suffer. Mm. They want a man with a big church, mm. a man with, you know, uh, yeah, people, a man with a car, a pastor with everything, or a businessman with everything. But you know how that businessman started. started. Maybe he took a loan. Yeah. Will you help him to pay for that loan? No. Then your mother will tell the hey. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Mm. You listen to your mom. So mm. you listen to your family because you have to go and bring says family fee So if you get money, Ubo ka, fako. Ubo ka, fako. yeah, yeah. Fabre fabre fie. Fie. And so yeah. all you are doing is you want money. When do you when? And when, when, when you get property. Bring it home, country, you know, when you get a heart thing, yeah, take it, take it to your husband. He deserves bad things. He deserves bad things. Uh, so that means if, if we know our duty as helpmates, then we will help the men to become what God wants them to be. Maybe the person might not be a big business tycoon. Mm -hmm. Maybe through your help, yeah, through your, your, support. your support, that man can become a businessman God yeah. wants him to be yeah, through you. Course. But you're going to be no, 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 man. behind every successful man. There's a, woman. There's a woman. So definitely, when you support a man, you'll be a great man. Exactly, exactly. Oh, and all would, the greatness will come to if you. If you go there with yeah. good, good motive and yeah. genuine motive, that is it. Then you'll be blessed. Yeah. But if you go there with divided mind, and if I get hundred, I have to hide fifty, and I have to give fifty. If I do this, you'll be hiding and hiding. At the end of the day, the man will also discern that you are hiding something from him. Yeah. Mm. You also start also to hide. Things from you. Yeah. And then at the end of the day, there's not going to be transparency. Yeah. Mm. It's understanding and divorce. Exactly. Thank so you. to add up, you know, it tells us that we helpers cannot be lazy. Mm. No. You cannot be a helper, but you are lazy. Yeah. You cannot be a helper, you are you are afraid of taking challenges or risk. Mm -hmm. You understand it? And you cannot be a helper if you don't know how to be submissive. No. Because uh, to before you can put your own uh, 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 vision down to help somebody's vision. 
you have to be very very submissive yeah like a slave who is always waiting for the instruction of a madam or his master you know so we have to be begin to see uh, our husbands as as the lord in your life exactly. so you are always waiting for that instruction from him okay. when something you don't understand you go to him you tell him with this instruction you are giving me i don't understand can you bring me by mm -hmm. you know can you really have to That's bring right. me up to date you know to actually explain to me and then you gather information about how to actually go about it and whatever that you need to enable you to accomplish it you pray and then you ask him so that it to be given to you to be successful amen amen i think our time is up our time is up uh, but before we give up uh, i want to say uh, apostle michael k i do say uh, thanks for watching us god bless you too uh, joseph kwame annan you've been with us throughout the whole program may god richly bless you um and others uh, of uh, Bishop Collins Edu uh, uh, the mighty, mighty, mighty man, mighty words, Kum Kumbu, <laughs> <laughs> heavy words. God bless you too for watching us. God bless you all for watching us. Najet, uh, Scott J, this is nice it's topic. <laughs> yeah, yeah, thank you for watching us. God bless you all. God bless you all. So, um, before we give up, do you have anything to say uh, to women, to men, just under one minute? Lady Rita. Oh, okay. Uh, <clears throat> it's a beautiful thing when you get married to the right person. And it's, it's more blessed when you get married to a God-fearing person. So, my one advice is please you shouldn't look at the time that is taken, especially with the women, that your clock is taken, age is on your side, all your friends are getting married. So you just rush in and go and fix yourself into some kind of, I don't know, that you will regret. Please, keep trusting in God. Because God's time is never late. And God's time is always the best. They always say, life, they... Uh, always put it, it's not how far, but how well it has been for you. So therefore, as a Christian, have faith. Have faith in God. And as a woman, gather all the knowledge you need together as a wife. Equip yourself with all the knowledge, the strengths you need. So that when the time comes and God gives you your husband, you will go in fully prepared. <laughs> so you go in fully prepared and to deliver your best and God will richly bless you. Thank you. Amen. Thank you, mom. Thank you. <laughs> mom, 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 mom. I'm really honored. Uh, really, uh, my really. advice, my advice to to both men, the, the male and the female. Um one thing I know is if you marry somebody and you start life afresh. From the scratch for the person it's a blessing and if you don't go in looking for a green pasture and you just go in and allow god to help you to be uh, the, the the help me that god is talking about you you will reap whatever you sow you are going to reap joy happiness submission everything mm -hmm. and also the men please um love please love the women Men, you find it difficult to love. Hmm. Some it's men, a baby. but men, they find it difficult. A man that will love is a man that is broken. Oh. A man that Holy Ghost has really broken. Okay. Yeah, you see that man carrying his wife back, that man is uh, you know, adoring the wife. That is the man that God has really broken. Mm -hmm. And so if you want to really be a broken man, then allow God to break you mm -hmm. so that you can be a proud husband, a proud mm -hmm. partner who is carrying the vision. That is all I can say. We love you and God bless you. Amen. Amen. And they should learn how to say thank you. Unless you are broken. Unless thank you are broken, you cannot say thank you. If I love you, you cannot say Man, you are hearing because me. Because the man, you have to pray for the man to be broken down. Next week, we're going to talk about. The man will think that 
I said, oh, tell your husband, you, tell your wife you love her. Oh, she knows I love her. She knows her. Oh, I know her. She knows that. She actually speaks more than words. She knows that. Men don't talk too much. The Bible says that. Adam, Man, uh, this is our time. Adam said, this is the bone of my bone and the flesh of my flesh. You she spoke gives, out. She gives a if the vibes. Ah. And so if you marry us, let the vibes let the ele ele Electricity. It shouldn't be just if they, after the wedding, there are no more romance, no more oh. vibes. You want to hear the vibe, you look beautiful. That a man who will just go past the wife and tell somebody, Oh, you look beautiful, your hair look nice. Meanwhile, the wife is standing there. You're <laughs> not me. Own. I'm not talking about you. I think I said not me. Uh, I'm not, not me. I'm not talking about men, you. you hear Some men. You hear. Some men. Is it read some no, solo? <laughs> We will talk about it. We, we will go for the next week. Yeah. We will talk about it. Why, see, I'm not why with that wife. Men... Then you tell your mama, you look beautiful. As I have told your wife, she looks beautiful. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Before you tell her, you say, oh, mama. 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 And who else? There will be too many, then it will be different meaning. We have a different meaning for that. Thanks, so Chairman. Uh -huh. So next week we talk about it. In two men, then the next week we have a reason. God have mercy. We thank God. Yeah. People of God. We thank God. We thank God. We just, just, just love it's lovely. So nice. So, so nice. Mm -hmm. Let me, let me, let me comment a little bit on what they've written. Uh, um, Cosmos greatness says, God bless you. God bless you too. Uh, Pastor, man of God, you are too unconscious. Long time. Mm -hmm. uh, bishop, they say Bishop of Afro with the West. <laughs> bishop the Bishop, oh, thank you, thank you. He says, More grace for great, greater works. Amen. And then he wrote again, He said, God richly bless you all for your availability. Uh, I said, I saw availability. And with your life, your life, Kakra. <laughs> God bless you, God bless you. God bless you, God bless you. Uh, it's really, it's really a privilege. Yes. So, uh, God has given us this chance to uh, speak to you concerning marriages. Uh, as I said from the beginning, uh, uh, when you are in a broken home or misunderstanding home, it, it affects all your lives, yeah. every aspect of your life. Yeah. You will not see progress in your lives unless you mend it. So uh, our great women of God has taught us the causes, the pros, and the cons. Yeah. Let us use it. And I know 100% is going to work in our marriages. Yes. And it's going to bring laughter. It's going to bring joy. It's going to bring happiness. Yes. It's going to bring understanding. If not for anybody, for the children. Mm -hmm. Because the negative side is going to affect them in their marriages. Mm -hmm. And the positive side is also going to affect them in their marriages. Mm -hmm. Whatever they are, just like a carbon copies. Mm -hmm. Whatever we portray at home, mm -hmm. that's exactly what they will take outside in their marriages. Mm -hmm. Do you want that? Mm -hmm. Do you want your daughter to behave goes and then she will come back mm -hmm. in a broken home? Do you want it? Would you be happy? Do you want your, your son remarry all the time? Mm -hmm. Would you be happy? Please. God has given us the solution. Let us use it. If you are hearing my voice, this is Pastor Prophet Kofi Koku speaking. Thank you, ladies. Thank you, moms. Yeah, thank you so thank much. You. Thank you for the for privilege. Coming. It's a privilege. Yeah. Until we meet again, also. this is Pastor's time. Yeah. God bless you all. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.